and we're rolling! What's up everybody? This is FD from Roll with FD. And today we're gonna bring you the Card Stock Trading Show. This is the first time we've been to the Card Stock Trading Show in Sherman Oaks. If you recall, if you look back, we went to their show in Tarzana. It was an outside show. That was a great show. This is a new location. Still a great location. So we're gonna browse around, look. You're gonna see a bundle deal filled with Kobe's and a whole lot of other players. So please stay, look for that. And before the end of this thing, you're gonna see me purchase a very good player's rookie card, numbered, autographed, die cut for a good price. So G, hit him with the jams, give him some scenic views, and show him the real deal Holyfield. Yeah! Who's rolling with FD? Who's rolling with FD? I'm rolling with FD. What? Who's rolling with FD? I'm rolling with FD. Talk to him. We're going to the fourth floor. As we come out of the elevator, we're walking up to the show, uh, turn the corner, and we see someone that we've met at previous shows. Always good. Just this today. This is nice. <laughs> this is nice, man. Number 99? I got it for a good price. Well, you're cooking, it. bro. Appreciate it. That's nice. I think he's going to be a very good quarterback, man. That's what I hear. I hear he's going to be And he well, doesn't so. get touched a lot, which is good. He's going to stay healthy. Enjoy those on you, okay. bro. Appreciate it. Yep. I'm always excited to come to the new location of a card show. I mean, we walk up, we walk in, we start looking around, looking at the layout of this place. Uh, it's filled with people. Vendors are everywhere, buyers are everywhere. We're ready to jump in. You got card bins, high-priced cards, low-priced cards, and everything in between. But this is all about the hobby. So it's about meeting and greeting people. That's the number one focus. What's your name? Douglas. FD, nice to meet you, man. Okay, how you doing? Where did you get this from? I bought that from a card shop in Escondido. Wow. I've never seen an unopened box. Interesting. Yeah, that's what I do. I, I'm a throwback man. All right. I'm storing the uh, Cerrito. Yeah, I got my stores right I'm a Cerrito. Follow me. We'll hit you up, sir. Appreciate that. Oh, yeah, bro. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is a classic card. Yeah. <laughs> kidding. Now, that's classic right there. <laughs> No kidding, huh? Oh yeah. What's good, everybody, man? It's your boy Kenny Chow. We back with another video. If you're new, you know what to do, man. Kenny Chow. What's the price on this? Arena? That's a rookie. Yeah. And it's all over the place. One sold for 89, 26. One sold for 100. It's all over the place. I'm gonna do 50 for it. 50? All right, I'm gonna keep that in mind. I'm gonna come back. Thanks. Oh yeah, I know. September, yeah. yeah. Will Smith. We'll see what he does with that role. Oh, he looks like he's killing it. I hope he is. Because that, their father was the catalyst of everything. That's what fathers are. Yeah, bro. That's what they should be, right? Yeah. I know I'm doing that with my boys. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, that's, that's what it's about. Yeah, I'll come back to you. What's up, brother? How you doing? I think I saw you in Santa Barbara. Yeah, how yeah. you doing, man? Good, good. How, how are you? Say? How you doing? Ah, uh, yeah. This is the real deal. I'm just here to help him. <laughs> A lot of different years. Oh, we got a whole mix. Yeah. A potpourri, if you will. How much is this Otani here? That's a gold border mini. It's 500. What about this Brady? The Brady I've got for yeah, right there. Yeah, 200. 200? Is that number? I don't think so. Okay. It's number 301. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Thank you, brother. Absolutely. Have a good one. Yep. yep. What's up, brother? Good. How you doing? Good, good. How's it going, man? All right. You setting up? Yeah, Anthony left, so uh, put his cards out. I'm going to come back to you when you set up, man. Cool. Who we were just talking about? I've never been to this show before. Yeah, very tight. A lot of people. There's a lot of likeables. Oh, yeah. No question on that. You do a lot of wrestling, MMA stuff, huh? Yeah, a lot of UFC. Some Pokemon. A little bit of football. All right. Seen a Lisa Leslie card before? That's nice. What's your Instagram? Pokey Hollow Fan. Pokey Hollow Fan. All right. Thank you very much. How's it going? What's up, brother? I don't know if you're looking for anyone. Just kind of browsing. What's up with this Mbappe back here? Uh, this one's numbered at uh, 165. Yeah. 200? Yeah. I got a uh, spike color. I'm asking for 250. Okay. What's your Instagram? Um, I break on. Break, Break these. Yeah. And you got golden boot? Yeah, golden boot is something that we're going to transfer over to eventually with full soccer. Okay. All right, brother. Thank you. As we walk in the show, we meet up with one of the great minds of the hobby. 
Roman. What's up, bro? We were wondering if you were going to be here. We knew I was going to show up. Yeah, we were just talking about that. Dude, this is the tightest Daddy. show I've ever been to. Did you come last time? Nah. This is the first time I've been here. It was wild. This last time it was over 2,000 people. Wow. What you pick up today? Anything? Nah, I just walked in. I saw Darnold, though. So I might pick up a Darnold. Oh, okay. We were talking to someone outside that pulled a Tyler Murray car. Pretty nice. I'll definitely look for you before we get up out of here. G and I are always humble when we run into people that have seen the show and watched the show. Also, father and son time is nothing but greatness. How you doing? How much is this? Six thousand. Six thousand? It's a great car, man. What about the uh, Luca in the back? So it's Seven thousand. Nice, nice, nice. All right, man. Thank you, bro. What's up? What's up? How are you? What's up, bro? How you doing? Pretty good. You got a lot to take in here, man. A lot of raw, a lot of raw. I see your, I see your channel. Thank you, bro. Thank you for watching. Yeah. I really appreciate it. How much is this CD like? What's your channel, bro? What's your name? FD. FD. Rolling with FD is the channel. Roll with FD. Yeah, that's my man, man. That's your guy. That's your guy. See now. I wouldn't say he's my guy, but uh, I think he's gonna be a decent player. One out of seven, huh? How much is this? Uh, four, but I can work with it too. N A R B. N A R B. Appreciate you, man. All right, bro. Awesome. All right. What's up, brother? How you doing? What's up, man? Back to play. You have a lot of different stuff here. Yeah, a lot of different basketball, a lot of Lucas, Kobe, a bit of everything. That Kobe car is cool. Both of those are cool. How you doing back there? You good? What's going on, man? You a uh, Kobe fan? He's, he's a Clipper fan. Where you got Kobe jersey? You a Clipper fan? Who's your favorite player on the Clippers? Beverly, who's your favorite player? Kawhi. I'm playing Kawhi. Okay. Oh, I feel that. All right, man. It's a pleasure meeting y'all. Nice to meet you. What's your name? FD. FD, Dick. All right, Dick. Nice What's your name? Billy. Billy? All right, Billy. Have a good one, man. I'm walking around the show, still got my eyes open for the bye. And I see two young giants in the hobby with some raw young kings on the court. Gotta stop and look. How much, how much is this? 30. 30? Let me see that card. This is Adam, and this is Giovanni. They picked up four cards for $100. Appreciate you, bro. Yeah. Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate it. All right, man. You have a good day. Mitchell, nice to meet you. You based on that one? Uh, yeah. You go to sure. shows also? This is the only one I've been to. We've got a great case, right? Thank you. Appreciate it. Been a collector for years. Uh, COVID hobby. I'm an engineer. Uh, 3D print a bunch of different stands. Let me know if you want to check anything out. Hey, how much is this LeBron fan? I do uh, 5K and I'd be firm on that one. How much is that? 3 k Yeah, there's a, little, there's a little wiggle room on that. I'd be 2800 This one's awesome. It's really tough grade. On card auto. See that car? Yeah, check it out. The beautiful thing about these stands too is they're fully adjustable, so you can fit top loader cards, you can fit this in here too. Did you make these? I think he's in house, yeah. All made in house. Very important. Sounds good. Nice Thank to meet you. you. Thank you very much. Yeah, appreciate it. Take care. What's going What's on? What's up, brother? RW, RWFD. What does that stand for? Rolling with Ooh. FD. All right. Oh, sure. How are you doing? Are you FD? I'm FD. The FD himself. This is G. FD and G. That's a lot of letters. It's like a quarter of the alphabet. <laughs> Who is this? Gary Matthews. He played in the 70s. I don't know Gary Matthews. Yeah, yeah, Gary Matthews. I'm from, I'm from Chicago. Oh, okay, there you go. There you go. And Gary Matthews Jr. played for a little while. Did Gary Matthews Jr. play for the Cubs? No, oh, he played for the Texans. Yeah, Texas. No, he was on steroids. He played oh, I didn't know that. No. Yeah. His career went straight down. <laughs> yeah. Nice I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Most of these I pulled, my, I pulled out with myself, Stan so Lee, off card auto, which was just oh, wow. crazy. And then I was big on trade for my whole life. I bought the rainbow and then traded it myself. It all came back. Oh, wow. And then this one's a, a unique one where I was looking at the rookie year, both, you know, that's 2016, the rookie year, and obviously now it's shortstop and second base. It's just a, a rare combination. And it's the one time where it's good to have Panini because they can't tell they're on different teams in there. Too. Sure, sure. So I'm gonna ask you a question. Yes, sir. I want to ask some people though. Absolutely. What's your take on this whole fanatic though? I, I think it's who knows if we'll ever know what really happened behind Probably the not. scenes. But I think there's a I'm gonna say optimistic there's a big upside with it if they can figure out how to better the actual like infrastructure of cars. That's exactly what I think, bro. They have the they have the, the distribution and they have the infrastructure already built. I think it could be a really good thing for the hobby. But I, I was saying that the material that goes in the cars, nobody has the material that Fanatics have. Yeah. 
the Governor took a game used jersey of Corey Seager from the World Series. Yeah. In the clinching game. Fanatics. I can put that in the car. Yeah. And see, that's what used to be great with like Upper Deck and Tops. They would show you the actual, exactly. where it came from. And Tops in the, even 2015, 16, they started doing that again with the stickers. Yeah. Now it's like Panini, it's, it's like not worn by the player at all, potentially. Yeah, it's like, yeah, exactly. So I, I'm staying optimistic. I, so I, I just hope that. Hawks will license Bowman. I'm a Bowman guy. Okay. I hope the name Bowman can stay. I don't know. We'll see what happens with the naming, you know? Don't be shocked with a lot of these names, but everybody yeah. in this room is used to these names. Yeah. So why would they go away? Exactly. Just to make the car. Yeah. Well, hey, Brian. get your FD. Yes, Brian, get to meet you, G. That was a great conversation. And as we keep moving, we see familiar faces from past shows. My man, Miles. How you doing? How you doing, ma'am? Nice to meet you. What's going down, bro? Check out the number. It's a nice card, man. You knew I would like this, right? I did. You took that Luca and uh, Patrick Mahomes? Yeah. Turns out a 15. It's nice. He's yeah, the one who still had his car with Jersey. Are you going to the LA Proper Show? I think so, yeah, yeah. I'm going to come back to you at the LA Proper Show. It's great to see you, man. Great cars, man. Nice meeting you. I just want to come out and say what's up, bro. How you doing? Good, man. I see you guys. You always still bring the heat. <laughs> I've offloaded a lot too, man. It's been a busy couple of weeks. How's your little baby doing? Baby's good. Baby's just turned a year. So. Good. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Now I got to pay for the baby, right? Well, you, you got some stuff. What are you doing? Edelman car, bond car, huh? Yeah, push them. Make sure. Yeah, I mean, a lot of stuff like these, I open packs myself and rated them. I mean, a lot of these I bought and they're already rated, so I, I, I know what my cost basis is. Thank you, brother. I'll run a story sell tomorrow. All right, bro. All right, man. Thank you. When you're at shows, always look for bargains because they're there. You'll see price pans. You'll see some form of a deal. Here, Merle from Merle World Cars has bins out, and everything in the bins are marked at half price. And I see a gem and Antonio Brown. Here now, been a member? Nothing. I'm like, dude, what does it take? Like, I've got this. FK. What's up, bro? Buddy. But you got everything out there, man. I know. I'm pulling all the weapons out. All of them. How you doing, man? How you doing? Good. Busy. Busy. I've been watching all your shows, dude. Your yeah. videos. Thank you, bro. You know, liking your Instagrams. Watching you with Dustin talk last week. <laughs> Enjoyed it. How often are you submitting? Every week. Okay. I'm always buying stuff, and then I just right. slabble. That's why I send them anywhere. Because I'm at that point now where if I try to sell a raw card, I can't. Because people are like, must be something wrong with it. Why is he selling a raw card when all he does is slaps? And so I've got to slap it. So I'll send it to SGC if I just want a quick turnaround, because I can get them in two weeks. Or like the stickers, or oversized cards, or or small cards. If it's a thick card, or like a uh, patch card or something thick, I'll send it to HGA, because they'll do the thick. Um, SGC won't. If it's a cool color match card, like cheap, then I'll send it to HGA or Revolution. Because they'll do, you know, the coloring on it as well. So that's kind of cool and it sells faster. You know, like the Nigel Houston right here. But and then you did the custom. So I like how they color matched it all. And he you know, had that out for the Olympics, even though he didn't do any well. <laughs> I'm going to end up taking that. Yes, sir. We just picked up an Antonio Brown rookie card. One out of 49 from Merle. Is it the black one? Oh, it's autographed too. Yeah, bro. It's a good one. Hopefully, he has a good year with the Buccaneers and Brady and Hope in so. fantasy football. Yeah, bro. So that price will go up. Pleasure. From you is always you. special, bro. Check out his show on YouTube, Bowling with FD. All right, this Merle. This is Merlin at Merle Carts. Hit up Merle, man. Pleasure, Thank man. you, brother. Pleasure. You have a good one. It's always good to see Merle and talk to him. But when I came into this show, I went by a table, and now it's time to go back to that table. Friendly Hill Sports Cards is the man. How you doing? Good, good. Hey, huh? sit down right there for a minute, man. Chill. Look at this breeze right here you got. <laughs> <laughs> I may make an offer for you on one of them green cards. Man, it's hard to price them. I imagine it is. I kind of want to hold them a little bit. You know? you know, if I was you, I probably would. I just needed to have those, man. It's his last signing I heard. I'm not, I'm not surprised. I don't think he gets enough credit for who he is and what he does. All time leading scorer. He does a lot, even to this day. And he's sick and he still cares. Bro, sick ain't the word. He's got some terminal yeah, illnesses. Bro. I mean, we said, well, he's had leukemia for years. I know. I and uh, from what I understand, he, yeah, he has more than that now. Yeah, man. It's always good seeing you, bro. Sure, man. Oh, yeah. I'll see you at the next show. Oh, yeah.
Great scene, Friendly Hills. We move on, bump into a seller who has a bundle of cars. Check this out. You like 90s stuff? Oh yeah. Yeah, man, I love 90s basketball. You take care of your cars too. So I still also it too, yeah. I, I took a lot of the stuff I was gonna grade, but like I said, I can't wait forever. So I was like, you know, I might as well make a little bit of money on it now. I'm actually originally from Oklahoma. Oh really? So I grew up and like was a big Sooner fan. Yeah. And, like, I don't know if you know anything about like Oklahoma football or anything. Yeah, I went to a game two years ago. But yeah, it's a good time to be a Sooner fan because we got three starting NFL quarterbacks in the league right now. Yeah. Murray, Baker and Hurts, mm -hmm. you know, Hurts is Alabama too, but you know, I got some slaps too, if you want to take a look. Look at my Garnets. That's cool, A-Rod and Hank Aaron. Those are tough grades. Player showcase. Mm -hmm. I got room on that one. What's the bottom on that? Would you say this was 160? Yeah. Probably at like 120. What about everything for 120? Yeah, let's do it. For you. you go with that? I got you. I like your channel. I want to support you. Appreciate that. You. So we're here with Justin. What's up? Justin has a lot of great cars. They bought a lot of various Colby's. Just a bunch of different stuff. I'm going to show you all this. I really appreciate yeah. you, brother. Yeah, man. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Support this yeah, channel. sir. Thanks we'll see each other again. Absolutely. Absolutely. Another beautiful day in LA. We're out here meeting people, talking to folks. I don't want anyone to miss ever, but that's really what this is all about. I learned stuff about people that I've met at other shows today. I learned more about their background. And I know there are all types of personalities out there. Some people, it's easy to talk to other people. Sometimes it's not for some people. But just maybe say, hey, I want to talk to one person today. And if you do that 15 times, you know 15 new people. I just enjoy the hobby and everything that it has to do, even outside of cars. Cars are the gravy on the mashed potatoes. Once we realize that, then we're winning. But G and I are about to kick it, get a little something for lunch, celebrate our wins today. Like, subscribe, hit the notifications. Let us know what you think of this content as well as others. We want to bring you more, we plan to. Thanks for your time today. Peace.